Hey guys, it's Charlie from Hide Music doing another unboxing video from our wonderful warehouse. If you like this content, make sure that you like and subscribe to our channel and uh, hit that bell icon to get notifications for when I do more really cool unboxing videos just like this one. Today, we're gonna be unboxing one of these really cool new guitars from Ibanez. This is the Q54. It's in a black matte finish. Uh, which, if you know anything about me, that is what I like everything to be. Black mat all the time. So, let's not waste any more time and get this thing unboxed. I naturally picked a table that has wheels on it right now. All right. Really cool little case for this. Uh, being one of the headless guitars, they come in like, it looks kind of like a violin case, obviously, or like a weird little mini cello. That is really cool looking. So these are the Q54s. Uh, kind of cool like throwback 80s sort of vibe that's coming back in a big way over the last couple of years of having the no headstock on here. The way that you actually string these is the ball end locks into the bridge right here and you just pull the string and lock it in right there and you tune and everything from down here. So a super, super nice guitar. Um, it's actually a roasted maple and babinga neck on here, and then roasted bird's eye maple for the fretboard. Then you've got the glow in the dark fret markers on the side, so if you're playing on a super dark stage, these will glow for the entire show. I think it's, I wanna say, I'm trying to remember, I think you get about like 45 minutes out of uh, charge on there. So they just charge like normal glow in the dark stickers, which is cool. Um, Got a coil tap right there too, which I own an Ibanez personally that has one of these on it. And I didn't realize how good a coil tap could be on a guitar until I actually used one of their systems. Um, really cool, offers just a bunch of different tone options, especially with it being an SS or HSS setup on here as well. Um, really cool guitar, incredibly light, but they still sound really fantastic. And just, you're gonna turn heads if you play on something like this. Oh yeah, there's another guitar that I was gonna unbox. Yeah, I am filming right now, Matt. Why? Did you have anything that you wanted to tell me on camera, Matt? Any confessions? Yes. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, when you say yes, that usually means you do the thing. <laughs> we also got in another one of those Q-series guitars. This is a uh, Q52 in laser blue, which I don't know how you could not be excited about a guitar in laser blue. Let's unbox it, huh? Another really cool, super tiny little case. I don't know why. I just love these things. I think it looks adorable. Oh, that is cool. Laser blue. This one comes obviously in the humbucker configuration. Still has the cool coil tap like the other one. Lets you split this into single coils, so even if you need to get like a Strat or a Tele sound, flip a switch, and you've got an extremely convincing Strat and Tele sound out of these pickups. But just really cool finish. Like, that is really, really pretty. Same uh, Lumile side and lay markers on there, glow in the dark. Really beautiful bird's eye maple fretboard on here. Really awesome figuring. And then cool like gold frets on it, which are supposed to resonate better and last longer. I don't know, but they look awesome on this fretboard. But really light, just all around cool guitar. If only we knew someone who played in like some sort of glam based 80s band that this would look perfect for. But you know, if only. <laughs> Come down to one of our locations, check it out. Uh, we've got the HSS and HH configuration. So yeah, check them out and try one of these out. They're really interesting and are definitely worth at least trying.
If you like guitars, we've got guitars. Forgot what I was gonna say. But uh, guitars are pretty cool. So I'm just gonna keep saying guitar over and over again, hoping that it jogs my memory as to what I was supposed to say. Be sure that if you like this video to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on all of our social media. We're uh, on Facebook, Instagram, and the TikToks as the teens use. And uh, yeah, subscribe to our channel, like I said. Hit that like button, because if you don't like it when you liked it, did you really even like it? And then uh, hit that bell for notifications so you get a little ring-a-ding every time we send a video out. Bye! Ha, ha, ha.